Nicole Scott here for Netbook News, and here we have the Huawei S7. This is one of the better build Android tablets on the market today. The build quality and the finish of the tablet is extremely good. It even comes with a little, little stand at the back here. Sounds quite solid, feels quite solid. Snaps in there. On the bottom we have a micro SD and a docking station, which is quite nice. If we go around to this side, we have the volume button and the tiny speaker. On the top, headphone, powers over there, and around this side, micro USB, which I really like to see, and there's your PSU. On the front, we have an optical touchpad there, so I can go around. It's very fast. Notice here, this is the phone dialer. If I hit the back button, I can actually call up the phone from right there. These are physical buttons, so this is quite nice on the side. And I believe this would hang it up on the end. And here we have the standard home menu and back. Now if we take a quick look at the settings here. All right, so you can see this is running Android 2.1, which is quite nice. Go back and take a look at home. Hmm. And it looks like I've pooched the tablet. <laughs> so I believe this is doing a restart right now. There we go. This is running on power. It was 0% uh, battery, so maybe that's why it restarted. But we can see how quickly this restarts on the uh, Snapdragon chipset. It's actually one of the one of the things we were very interested to see this here. Um, we were all very unsure what chipset this was actually going to um, come out on. So there we go. We're back. So let's start it here again, and we can actually access. Android Marketplace. So now we're hoping that this is going to come standard built in and it won't just be hacked on. So that's uh, something interesting to look forward to. So I'm Nicole Scott down here at the Qualcomm booth with the Huawei S7. I'm very excited to see this come out. Very solid sounding tablet.